Azalea plant belongs to the rhododendron family and happily grows under the shade. Many of my friends have said that it is quite difficult to grow azalea plant at home. But it is not that difficult if you use the perfect soil mixture and know how to care them properly. In this video, I am going to show how to grow and take care of azalea plants and get maximum blooms. It is the end of September in India. The average temperature is around 35 degrees centigrade. It is the perfect time to plant or repot the azalea plant. If everything remains perfect, you will start getting the flowers from the month of February when the temperature goes down around 25 degrees centigrade. Based on your location, the timing may differ from here, but the temperature ranges will remain the same. I bought this plant one month ago at 250 Indian rupees. The growth of the plant has stopped. It is suffering from leaf spot disease. This happens due to the fungal infection. Today I will report it. The main thing is the soil mixture. Azalea loves acidic oil drained soil. I am using a mixture of 25% cow dung compost, 25% organic manure, 20% cocoa peat, 20% ordinary garden soil and 10% sand. I will add some neem cake dust. This will prevent the insect and pest attacks to the soil. It also adds NPK and other useful elements like magnesium, sulfur, zinc, copper, iron, manganese etc. after decomposing. I will also add some fungicide to protect the plant from the fungal attack. To take the plant out, heat the pot gently. This will loosen the soil and you can pull the plant out very easily. I will plant it in an 8 inch pot. First, block the holes of the pot. Fill the pot half. Lose some soil, then plant at the center of the pot. Press the topsoil a little Add water and put the plant under full shade After 3 to 4 days, put it under partial shade As I mentioned earlier, now the temperature is 35 degrees centigrade I will not put it under direct sunlight, but it should get enough bright light In the last week of October when the temperature goes down around 30 degrees centigrade, I will put the plant under full sun. It will remain there for the whole winter. This is after 50 days. It is the first week of November. The plant is kept in full sun. It is stable now. The fungal infection has gone. New leaves have formed. After 143 days. The plant is growing nicely. It has started producing the buds. This is 152 days after the reporting. The plant has produced two beautiful flowers. The next day they have fully bloomed. After 162 days, more buds and flowers are there. Day 165 A lot of buds are ready to be bloomed. Let's talk about the water requirement. This plant needs a lot of water, but the soil should not hold extra water. Try to keep the soil moist by adding water frequently. This is after 
170 days of reporting the azalea plant. It is in full bloom right now. Let's talk about the most important thing, the fertilizer that I have used. From the beginning, I used rotten mustard cake solution once in 15 days. This fertilizer can easily be made by decomposing mustard cake in water. It is the perfect source of natural NPK that is nitrogen, phosphorus and potassium. I also did another thing. I made a fertilizer mixture containing 40% bone meal, 30% blood meal, 25% horn meal and 5% superphosphate. I used this fertilizer only two times, once in December and once in January in the interval of one month. Remember, you have to stop adding all types of fertilizers before one month of the flowering season. That is the month of February in India. When you see the birds, again start adding the liquid fertilizer only. This is exactly what I have done and the result is in front of you. If you have azalea in your home, please share your experience in the comment section below. If you have any suggestion, please share that too. If you like the video, then hit the like button and subscribe my channel. That will really be helpful. Thanks for watching the video until the end. Have a nice day.